Well, hello, it is the last day. The last day of Vloon, y'all. But it's time to go downstairs because I've been done working for a while now. But something really fun just happened. And by fun, I don't mean actual fun. It's real dumb. Anyway, so I just got a call from the vet because, you know, Doyle and I went to the vet yesterday. Trauma, still. Anywho, so Doyle has been on the same, he takes seizure medication, he's been on the same medication for several years, right? So, they refilled his same prescription that he always gets. That's fine, got it filled, thought I was being super proactive, Sam's Club emails me, or not emails me, I'm sorry, they text me as soon as I get the prescription, I gave him a call, I said, yep, go ahead, charge me for it and mail it to me because it was gonna be a while before I'd be in that area again, right? So, Emily being the good puppy parent, sets everything in motion and now the vet literally just called me five minutes ago and said, yeah, I don't think we're gonna keep him on that medication or they're keeping him on the medication but just not at that dose. And let me show you what they are. They're actual capsules. They're not, hold on, let me turn. Like this is what they are, they're capsules. And she wants them to be half of what this is. This is 100 milligrams. She wants them to be 50 milligrams. Capsules, I can't cut in half. Doesn't work that way. So, of course I call Sam's Club right away and I say, hey, has that mail went out yet? And they said, oh my God, yeah. They just picked it up. There's nothing we can do. And I said, well, what if I don't open the mail? It comes to me, but I don't open it. Can I bring it back? And they said, no, we can't return any medication for legal reasons, which I totally understand. It's not Sam's Club's fault, but I'm just like, really? So if you ever want to just like throw $60 in the toilet, you can join my club, okay? Because um, it's actually not like horrible. His medication, when I got it priced out, I think when I first arrived in Fargo, I got it priced out and it was like 300 something dollars at CVS. I don't know. There's like a huge disparity in um, medication prices at certain pharmacies. So anyway, I get it at Sam's Club because it's the cheapest there. And so now I have to go get the uh, 50 milligram capsules, uh, which they're gonna be writing a prescription for tomorrow. So anyway, <laughs> it's just, the drama is endless. Ugh, anywho, so I'm just putting things in my little crawl space that's still not totally organized. <laughs> At some point, we'll get to it, I don't know. Anyway, but I'm gonna make some dinner here and um, I think I'm just gonna make, I don't know, I don't know what I'm gonna make today. Anything look good in there? We don't know. Let's find out something. Uh, but I gotta take Doyle out because he's in his spot. You know, we gotta, we gotta end the day on, on a Doyle dog. <laughs> anyway, but I will uh, check in with you guys in just a little bit, bye. I made a decision, you guys. I made a decision for the pastaroni situation, so. That is happening, which is good. I'm excited about that. I don't know, sometimes it's just like, make a decision, y'all. Anyway, um, but I got my pot, pan, whatever, going already, so that's good. But um, I wanted to say on the video, say thank you for all of the nice, constructive comments on my last video, which is, my Erin Condren update, I'll link it if y'all are interested in watching it. Most of you that watch the vlogs, which clearly is not everybody because the vlogs never get uh, the viewership that like regular videos do, which is totally fine, not for everybody. And um, I just wanted to say thank you for being kind and courteous in the comments. We all don't have to agree, which is totally fine. We're all adults here, but um, constructive criticism is always a great thing. Uh, a few people have told me that they are leaving and are not gonna be, you know, joining me back on the channel because they just can't support me using EC products. Totally get it. I'm fine with that. Um, so yeah, but I just wanted to say thanks for all of that. And also, thanks for Vloon. This has been like a very... <sighs> 
this month has just been a lot, as you guys know. So it's been good to document it. I feel like it's been really good to document this whole journey um, of just, you know, here's my raw feelings of what I feel about a certain situation or just my everyday what's going on and all that good stuff. So, but yeah, I mean, thank you guys for, for sticking with me for another balloon. I think that's like the third, maybe fourth year. I can't remember how many years I've done this. It's been a lot of years. <laughs> so anyway, but thanks for that. And um, yeah, I'm gonna make my pastaroni hair, my angel hair with herbs. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna have this for dinner. And I'm gonna check in with you guys in a little while because nothing exciting is going on. But y'all signed up for this, so. I'll be back and I'll talk about nothing in a little bit. Bye. All right, so dinner has been had. My hair is all sorts of wackadoodles, which is fine because I ain't going anywhere. And uh, yeah, so I'm gonna head back upstairs. I think this is gonna be my last little clip of the vlog because I would like to get this edited this evening. That's the goal. And um, yeah, I like to be ahead of the game, you guys. <laughs> Sometimes in the world of the YouTubes, which by the way, YouTube is also kind of a dumpster fire today. My good gravy. Oh, you know what? This is not gonna be my last clip because my battery light's flashing. I'll be right back. Okay, hey. <laughs> um, yeah, so today YouTube is just wild. Not because of my video, because I have like a little tiny speck of the interwebs. Um, but yeah, I follow a lot of the people in the beauty space. Uh, that's kind of how I started watching YouTube, to be honest. And I watch a gal, her name is Ingrid Nielsen, and she just made her last video on YouTube, which is really sad. She hasn't really focused too much on like beauty stuff in a while, but I remember watching her, I mean, she's been on the YouTube platform for like a decade, and I remember watching her for a very long time before I started my channel. And it's just sad to see her leave the platform, but she's doing it on her own terms. And I don't know, I'm excited to see whatever her future has to hold. And she still she said she'll still be on her own like social media, um, but not as someone that is a influencer anymore. She's now done with that. So, which I totally respect. Anyway, so that's really sad, but also, I understand, you know, when you're in your 30s and you're trying to figure out what you want to do full time. I mean, she said in her video too that she always knew that in her 30s she would stop putting out videos and this was just the right time for her and I get it. But, speaking of the beauty space, oh my god. I've also been watching another gal named Tati for years and years and years and years. I think I started watching her, I, I'm pretty sure I subscribed to her when it was like her channel was like less than a year old. Um, she used to do, I think it was five days a week, makeup looks, reviews, tutorials, um, swatches, like all different types of things like re regarding makeup and skincare and some lifestyle, but mostly like makeup and skincare. By the way, Tati is like absolutely gorgeous, like inside and out in my opinion, and um, she hasn't been on the platform in a really long time, and you know, I'm sure there was a lot of speculation or whatever, but today she came out with a video basically exposing some other individuals, and oh my gosh, it's just, just another dumpster fire of 2020. But I understand she needed to speak her truth, I get it, but man, whew, the YouTubes are just wild today. So, hoo, hoo, hoo. but speaking of wild, Doyle's down there being a wild little baby. Let's see if Doyle will say hello to you guys. Hold on. You want to say hello? Come here. Come here. <gasps> oh. We got to get some good Doyle content. It's the last day of the month, bud. I know. Stop recording you for just a little bit. Boop, boop, boop. Yeah. Can you sit down? I'm gonna do some tricks. Can you sit? Bobo. Can you sit down? No. Can you sit down? No, he does not know how. He is broken. I have a broken dog. Yeah, you're broken, huh, buddy? Oh, Doyle! Hey, get back here. 
Come here. The worst. Come here. Come here. Hey, come here. Oh my gosh. <laughs> like, he stays like just far enough away. Just, just far enough away from me. <laughs> oh, what it's like to pet Doyle. It's an experience, you guys. It's an experience. But he runs away as soon as he's done being pet. He's like, nope, I'm over it. You over it? No? You want some more pets? Okay, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, yep. Now shake it off, bud. Shake it off. Oh, what do you think? Doyle. Doyle. Okay, well, he's just going to stand around now. <laughs> anyway, but yeah, I am going to call it quits. Thank you guys so much for watching the series. If you're interested in watching the rest of the series or catching up or anything like that, there's a link below that has all of the Vloon uh, videos there that have spanned several years. So hope you guys enjoy. Like I said before, it's been a very, very interesting month, a very trying month, but i um, glad I can document, you know, my little space of the internet and my little life for you guys. So um, yeah, I really appreciate you guys watching and supporting and just always being so kind in the comments and just being like, you know, you guys are awesome human beings. I just have to say that you guys are just awesome human beings. So just thank you for being you. And if you are a long time creeper and you've never commented, I encourage you to write a comment in the comment section below and just introduce yourself of like who you are, maybe what area you live in and you know, just any little like tidbits of information, maybe what, you know, your favorite things are in the world. Like, just let me know. It'd be nice to get to know you guys. So anyway, thank you for coming along on this journey. There will be more vlogging series coming up at some point, so stay tuned. And um, I'll be vlogging once in a while just for fun anyways. So um, yeah, that's it. going to be it for me. Thank you so much. And I'm going to see you guys actually very, very soon with more fun content. Won't be vlogs, but whew. July is packed, you guys, so stay tuned. Make sure to thumbs up, subscribe, make those comments, and I'll talk to you guys very soon. Bye! Well, folks, it's time to kick it old school.